Welcome. Today we are here to film another episode of In the Wild. Our natural habitat today that we will be exploring is a suburban home. This home resides just outside of the Philadelphia area. We're going to take a walk through today and see what we can discover. Join me. We'll ignore the domestic house cat as we begin our journey. We'll travel down the corridor here and see if we can come across something even more spectacular. There it is, just over the horizon. Let's see if our camera crew can get a bit closer without startling this incredible specimen. This is a rare, rare occurrence today as we've stumbled upon an incredible beast. Let's get closer. This particular specimen is handmade. That's right, we're seeing an up close piece of ceramic artwork that was handmade. In fact, this particular species was made by Mrs. Thompson back when she was in 10th grade. That makes this piece, well, old. We'll just leave it at that. We've received special privileges from the owner of the land to actually interact with this particular specimen you can see that it's made of a series of bowls connected with details added. Let's move past the domestic house cat once more. We'll see if we can locate any other fabulous finds here in the wild. As we close in, this particular landscape is a common one the American kitchen and dining room. And in this particular environment, we'll find a common species. This specimen is used by most other creatures in the kingdom. It is so important that without it, other creatures would find a hard time eating. This particular version has actually traveled quite a distance. Its origin is from a far off land called Ikea. Let's see if we can locate any more fabulous finds today. We'll enter a more private territory and see if we can locate anything special. Just around the corner. Our cameras should be picking up. I believe we may have stumbled upon a herd, an actual herd. Let's see if we can close in on them and capture them for you, our viewers. With the herd contained, we can approach. Hopefully, we don't scare them off. That's right, we've stumbled upon a large herd of ceramic tiles. In fact, we have two different types of species here. You can see a white porcelain tile offset by more of a marble finished tile. Fascinating to see both groups all in one location truly a spectacle. Let's see if we can find anything else. Don't worry, you're safe from where you are viewing, but our crews do need to back away slowly. This particular specimen is quite the find. As it sits currently, it is guarding a large 
collection of toilet paper. We must be very, very careful in this position. The toilet paper is hard to come by. We will back away so that this predator does not see us as a threat. This has been quite a day. A porcelain toilet, such an important ceramic find here in this suburban home. What would we do without this majestic creature in our environment?